dog grooming is one of the most popular careers for those in the dog lovers value chain one of such is Erica Dai, who has channeled his passion into a business venture. Eric Adai has been running the dog business for the past 15 years, but decided to move into mobile grooming, which he's been doing in the last three years. And we caught up with him here at the Regimental Grey Estate to look at how business is faring for him. For 39-year-old Eric, dog grooming is only an aspect of his work with dogs. It takes more than just the love for the home pet. I buy the dog, I cut their nails, I clean their ears, and also um, I check the skin if there's any issue. If there's anything, I, can, I will let the owner know so that they can just treat it or maybe take good care of it. He's just one of many young people who turned dogs in the latest craze of human dog relationships. On a regular day, Eric does at least four visits to do what he has come to master. I do it from Monday to Saturday. Mm. Yeah, but uh, normally Saturdays are a bit busy because most of the clients are in the house. So they like Saturdays. Mm. Okay. Well, you can see their dogs being groomed. And, do and after the day's work with satisfied clients, healthy dogs, and Eric is a happy man. He would go at it the next day. The grooming part, there's a lot of challenges because of uh, we don't get the tools here. You have to order it from outside. Uh, some of them, the dogs, they are aggressive. Mm -hmm. So to even hold them like how this one is calm and sweet is very difficult. But is this rewarding enough to keep us a job in the face of the economic crunch? It's a big, 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 big business in Ghana. Now. In Ghana. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you can enter one house, you meet like 10 dogs, you meet like 5 dogs, 6 dogs. The prices goes according to the distance and also the big, the size of the dog. I charge from 170 up. Maximum can be 400 Ghana. Pastor, okay. come. Dog rearing has become an integral part of people's lives, so much so that some develop more than a bond with their dogs. I just love having them around. Man's best friend, Pascal, joined us this year. So Pascal is really Nasha's companion. I think people invest in different things. Right. Some people buy shoes, some people buy bags. We do dogs. Whichever reason you decide to keep a dog, key thing, they must be properly cared for. And so long as they remain with us, they would be part of our lives. Nana Ikuya, Mensa Abrampa, TV3.